I am in day seven of self-isolation and yeah, I actually cannot stare at these roots anymore. So, we're gonna highlight my hair. I'm gonna hi highlight my hair, you're gonna watch and pray for me. Um, so, yeah, I'm just gonna get into it and I don't recommend doing this if you are not a hairdresser. I'm even wondering like, should I even be doing this on myself? But these things need to be done, okay? Nowhere is open, so, you know. Like I have, I don't know if you can tell on the camera, but it is basically just the blue that's after fading out. So I have a nice minty kind of color as well that I'm going to put in as well today. And um, yeah, let's hope for the best. doing just the sides I didn't even attempt to do the back or the bottom or anything and oh my god my arms are killing me and my neck and my back are so sore I don't know how people do this on themselves all the time um yeah no um I have braided my hair for six hours before my arms were not this sore not that I remember but um yeah, there and now, gonna let them 
it's set and it's a nice day out so I'm gonna go downstairs have a cup of coffee and just wait and just make sure to check them and everything as well so I'll be back when they're this is the current situation I'm after rinsing off and I look like Slim Shady but I'm going to dry all this now and then I'm going to pop in my colour so I could have left it on a little bit longer but I got nervous and I washed it off but like we're just gonna let the colour do its work rinsed off and I have put, I have rinsed off, blow dried my hair, just roughly blow dried it and I put um, the peppermint green from Crazy Colour in on top of my hair. Now I didn't have enough of it so I mixed it with a lot of conditioner so it might come out, uh, it might not come out as vibrant as I like but I mix a little bit of blue up as well and I just kind of put it on my roots because they were starting to look a little bit crazy but um, I'm not gonna lie I am kind of nervous about this but grand we're in quarantine anyway so it's not like we're going anywhere so yeah that's just what I'm going to tell myself Heck. so here is the color here's my roots um I'm actually quite happy with how it came out I was looking a little bit mental there for a while until I put on makeup and Mark was just looking at me like oh Jesus Christ but um he's used to me doing things like this but being honest he was scared about this one being honest so was I but yeah, I'm really happy with how it came out. No more dark roots in there. And yeah, got like one leak and missed one or two spots. But all in all, I'm happy with how it came out. I don't think it's too bad. I also went ahead and just used the sock curls again. If you didn't see my last video on the sock curls, you can check that out too. Um, yeah, happy now. It's grand. So like that, I just want to say again, if you are not a hairdresser, please do not do this at home. Um, no matter what you see on TikTok or what videos you watch, bleach is very, very hard to work with. Um, I'm not going to lie, I could have left mine on a little bit longer and I could have done with heat, but I didn't have access to any heat um, to put my head underneath. So this is it, this will do. Um, yeah, if you want to see how I keep my hair topped up this color, let me know. Anyway, bye for now. Thank you.